I guess I like filming in the bathroom? Maybe? <laughs> I don't know. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're doing kind of like this easy, simple, natural makeup look for school because we all have those mornings where we wake up late or we just don't feel like putting on makeup but we want to anyways. So I'm just going to show you guys what I do for my face on a school morning as well as reveal one of the biggest secrets you guys have been wanting to know. Which is how I do my eyebrows. You guys have been asking me this for a long time and like half the comments I get on my channel are always about my eyebrows so I have to delete all of them because it's nothing related to the video. So today we're gonna do some makeup stuff even though I'm not a beauty guru per se. We're gonna just get right into that. I realize I forgot to throw in there that once you get the hang of this makeup routine it's very, very simple to follow along and should only take you five minutes to do. Also, if you want my skincare routine, I will have that up there in the card. So, um, yeah, back to the video. Just take off the hood. I just don't feel like showing. Okay, my hair is not that bad. It's fine. It's not bad. So, first and foremost, don't spend a lot of time on foundation if you're running late for school. Or if you just don't want to put on a whole lot of makeup. What I always do is, okay, first of all, I use Fit Me by Maybelline. It's like this, the lid screwed on wrong, but yeah, you know, it's fine. Um, it's um, Toffee Caramel 330. I normally pick one that is a little bit darker than my usual color because on a day when I have to go to school or I'm running late, I only put foundation around the edges of my face, so it's kind of like contour by using something a little bit darker and it doesn't take up a lot of time or make your face greasy. We wet my beauty blender, which is very dirty. And we're going to just take a small amount and go around the edges of my face um, to just blot out. You know, I just don't use a whole lot of it. Um, I just use enough to blot out the edges of my face. And if there's trouble spots, usually they're in the corners of my face. So I just do a little bit of that. Not huge amounts, you just need to blot just a little bit, just enough to cover up and just enough to kind of have it act, like I said, as a contour for your face. So not too dramatic of a change on your face, just a little natural looking foundation. See, there you can't really tell what's going on there, but here we are. Mm -hmm. Some concealer, also maybe line fit me. And it's 50 in Cafe. Uh, is it gonna focus? It's not gonna focus for me. We just love it when it does that, right? I'm trying to show you guys the products I use. It's not showing it in focus. It's fine. It's, it's fine. Sorry for my mini tantrum, guys. Only put concealer on the trouble spots. I don't do my under eyes usually. Do I want to do that for this video? Nah, we're gonna skip that. But I have like a couple of zits like right there. Okay things just popping out of my face because I'm stressed out about transferring to a university. Life sucks. So we're just gonna put a few blocks. I don't understand why this one is still there. It's been there for like literally two weeks. I don't know. Um, yeah, we're just gonna blot out these few things. And then we're gonna go in the blender to blend them off so they look kind of naturally covered up. I don't think I'm punching myself in the face with a beauty blender. That sounded so weird, but yeah, okay. I'm gonna go ahead and put on some Carmex. Kind of really important here. Um, I don't do lip stuff on school days unless I'm feeling sassy and want to put on like lip gloss or some like tinted lip moisturizer. That's about as far as I go. Next on the list is eyebrows. So I'm gonna show you guys exactly how I do them. Because you guys have been waiting for this for a long time. So, first of all, hold on, where did I? Okay. First, I use this CoverGirl Perfect Liner stuff, Perfect Blend, I think it's called, um, in black. And that's what I use to outline my brows. So, we're gonna do that. Um, this is gonna be a little weird, but it's, it's gonna be fine. And then after that, I go in with Easy Breezy Brow. Rich brown and fill in. So I'm gonna show you guys. And I blend out with the the brush end of brow precise because I'm just I don't use this end. I just use this end because I'm weird like that. Anyway, let's just do this. 
So normally I draw like a few hairs like there. And then I do like a complete outline of both brows just with this darker color because that seems to bring out more of how it actually looks. And yeah. So basically I do kind of like this on both sides. It's kind of hard to see because the lighting is weird. Let me move it around just a little bit so you guys can actually see. But basically I do that to both sides. And then I basically I have the basic outline of what I normally do. So this is what normally happens. And then I draw like a couple hairs like in between. Like there in those spaces just a little bit. Like I just put a few dots of the darker color. And then I go in with a lighter color just like to shadow parts of it. So the gaps and then we're good for blending. And we take Brow Precise Micro Pencil and use the brush end because their brush is like really really good for eyebrows. So I just do I'll just show you guys kind of what I I just kind of like blend it up, you know? Do the whole blending of the eyebrows thing. So yeah. If there's any gaps still in the brows, I normally still go in with the darker one and just like to just like kind of finish it off, give it some finishing touches. And there's normally not a whole lot I have to do, but like not least, I normally kind of blend out the rest of my eyebrows with my fingers. Like I kind of block the ends of them so it looks more natural like. Kind of like that's so that way we don't have like this huge block thingy at the ends of my eyebrows. So there we are. We look good. We look glowing. Well guys, that is it for today's video. I hope you liked it and I finally revealed how I do my eyebrows every single day. They do look good still. They look okay. Like they are not fully blended out. But it's fine. You guys basically know what to do now. So buy a dark pencil and a slightly lighter one and you do that. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't yet, and hit the notification bell so you don't miss any future videos. I will be doing more back to school videos as, as it is back to school season. Some people are going back to school this week and next week, so I will have content out specifically tailored for that. And don't forget to keep up with me on my social medias, on Instagram, Snapchat, and Twitter at TheRealTMONA, and I will see you guys in a video soon. Bye!